Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am in the car, haven't done that in a while, <laughs> driving and filming. Uh, right now is 8 uh, 05 p.m. right now in the evening. I'm going to my cousin's house. Uh, her daughter's birthday is this Sunday. So she asked me if I can come over and help her out with a balloon garland. It's gonna be a very a pretty theme. It's gonna be white, a little bit of pink, uh, maybe, no, white and pink with some butterflies. So very, very cute. Me personally, I love butterflies and I don't know how um, lighting will be with my phone because I forgot my camera. Stay with me if you want to see the whole process. Stay with me. And you guys, she bought all of the supplies. I'm coming there just to blow the balloons and construct the balloon garland. So stay with me. Let's go. I am here. The lighting is terrible. I look very orange. But hey, I really wanted you to see how I do it if I do uh, the balloon garland for somebody. So I have my balloon pump like usual. Um, my safety pins, my uh, 20 pound um, fishing line, glue gun, low heat glue gun. You guys, there's difference between uh, low heat and high heat glue gun. And high heat will give you a really, really super duper hot glue and low, it will just melt the glue stick and it will not pop your balloon. So don't worry about that. Uh, what else do I have? I have my tying tool. Um, as I said, all of the balloons uh, my sister, my cousin, has. She bought them. And uh, yeah, let's go and make this happen. to hang this balloon garland I we are using decided to try to use it command hooks and these are really small and cutesy ones so we'll see how it works so these hooks are half a pound and these are really really tiny ones so like for keys hanging we'll see how it's gonna work
guys, our balloon garland is finished. These butterflies, they add so much to a balloon garland. So beautiful. These balloons are so adorable. Where did you get them, Tanya? Party City. So these um, confetti balloons, they're actually not a confetti, but they're like painted confettis. So very cute. And these butterflies, some of them are 3D like these. They do have magnets, but we didn't do magnets. We just used a low heat temperature glue gun and just glue it to balloons. And these guys, they're like more plasticky, but they look beautiful anyways and they were bought on Amazon. And the rest of the balloons, where did you get balloons? Uh, Amazon. Amazon. Amazon, most of Okay, these are Party City right here. These pink ones, they are from Walmart and the rest of the balloons, they are from Amazon. These guys over here, they are more translucent than on the video. They're like pearl, whitish, translucent balloons. And those big ones, they are 36 inch balloons. I am honestly not sure how many balloons we used. I'll try to count it up for you guys and tell you a little bit later. So here you have it. This is how I do balloon garlands for clients. This is wasn't really a client. She was my cousin that was helping her out, but I treated her as a client. I love to go to uh, people's houses or the venues where balloon garland will be placed so you don't have to transport the garland. Uh, the, if you're transporting the garland and kind of trying to shove the garland into your car, there's a great possibility that balloons can or will pop. So to avoid that, I, I love to go to uh, people's houses or the event or the venue where the party will take place. So I can hang the balloon garland, I can fill in spaces comfortably on the balloon garland and it would stay there and it would look beautiful. Uh, some people would come to my house to pick up the balloon garland and that's up to them. Um, other than that, if you want to see in-depth DIY and tutorial on a balloon garland, it's not a problem. I do have a few videos where I don't fast forward too much and I do explain more. I will link those videos in the description under the video. Everything we used uh, in this balloon garland, I will link in the description under the video as well. If you have any other questions, please comment down below. And uh, yeah, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button down below for more videos. And by the way, I do look different than from the beginning of the video because I was uh, coming from um, our annual kids camp that we have every year. So I was there, I was helping out with the DIYs and uh, kind of watching kids uh, uh, during pool time. Um, I was exhausted. I don't know how people did that for a whole week, like physical stuff, like cooking and uh, games and all of this stuff, props to them. And yeah, I was just, I just, it just slipped my mind. I forgot my camera. I, I forgot to film an outro for the video. Anyways, I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day and I will see you back very soon. Bye.